hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa in today's video we are doing a may bb craft project share and review so let's get started Hey guys, so I just want to thank BB Craft for sponsoring another video. Thank you so much. Their website and all the links to all the products will be in the description below. And I have a code wetpaint5 where you can save $5 off a $40 purchase. You can use it at checkout. And please stay to the end of the video because I'm going to be talking about their YouTube program a little bit. Okay, because I do have a YouTube program, guys, if you have a YouTube channel, all right? So let's get started with the first thing I got, these beautiful set of five uh, tie, tie, tag dies. <laughs> all right, they're nesting dies. Um, you could ob obviously use them separately. You could definitely use them separately, but here is the first tag I made. Alrighty, so I used some Tonic Studio spray and I also used a stamp and I colored in the stamp as well. Here is that first beautiful tag. Here is the second one, this, the one uh, just lower in size. Here's the back and the front again using a stamp and I used some distressed spray. Here is another beautiful tag I used with flowers. And again, I used a stamp and some Tonic Studios, um, Jewel Drops, and I diamond dusted it. Home Sweet Home. It's really beautiful. I love these uh, dies. And this that actual die is from AliExpress, but these were perfect for tags to fit the other dies. So this is gorgeous. And I just left that plank, so I want you to see the stitching of what the tag would look like. Coffee and joy, that is me. I am very joyful when I have coffee. All right, and here is another one with the smallest um, die right there, the tag. And again, I left the plank so you could see the stitching in it. And it is really beautiful, and I love the papers I use with it. It's, very, it's just perfect. It, like, it was perfect timing. Just gorgeous. I love these tags. They, are, they cut very, very well. They're very, very sharp. And on to the next. All right, so the next thing we have here is the 12 by 12 stencil. I have to clean a little better, but I did use some tonic uh like paste the glacier pastes and this moonstone paste these i love these and they worked really really well and then i also use this other glitter paste here by uh tonic studios with my little blending brush there okay so and uh, it did get flattened out a little bit so anyway here we go this i believe is the glacier paste and the glitter paste and on this beautiful sheet of paper I love the way this came out. It just made this sheet with the starry sky just even more beautiful. And here is a darker sheet so you could see the contrast. Look how gorgeous this stencil is. It came out perfectly. This beautiful butterfly moon with like the waves on the bottom. It is really a gorgeous stencil. I absolutely love it. And you can use sections of it. You don't have to use it. The whole thing, you just use the butterflies. You can use just the waves. So on to the next. All right. So first, here is the acrylic block with the um, acrylic clear stamps on them. Okay. So just a quick little tutorial. Most of you guys don't need this, but if you guys don't know how, some of you guys are out there, you don't know how to use a, uh, the block. You just dab the ink, okay, onto the clear stamp, and then you place the stamp on the acrylic block to hold it in place. It literally sticks on there, like almost like a suction cup. Then you need to press down, 
place it where you want it. Just press down there. I press kind of heavy just to make sure all the ink comes off. Lift it up, and there. Simple as that. There is your beautiful stamp. You can use any color. I love to layer colors as well. And then you can cut it out. Here's the other one. So you get two sizes with this kit. With the acrylic uh, clear stamp kit, you get the larger acrylic block and the small one. And here's one way you could do it. You can cut out right out of the paper or just leave it on the sheet there. Just like that. Sometimes I like to cut them out. I like to color them in. So, very quickly, I'm just going to show you the clear stamps again. These beautiful stamps. I am in love with them. This whole kit is gorgeous. Like, it's literally right up my alley. Beautiful. You get such a wide variety of different types of stamps. And I believe there's something there for everybody. Butterflies. That's that one right there. If I could pick it up. There you go. Gorgeous. I love it. I love these stamps. And it is a great, great deal for $15. You get all these stamps. Here's the other butterfly and this one is gorgeous with the clouds the dream catcher the pinwheel just beautiful and these cute little guys much smaller and actually that's great because again you get a very wide variety of clear stamps all right so here is the projects that I made the stamps right there on the back and if you love this video, please, guys, don't forget to subscribe, share the video. It would be really appreciated. So here is a very cute card I made, the easel card with the stamps right there. I cut them out and I pasted them down. I glued them down on the sides there. Beautiful day. And here is the back of it. And I love that sunflower. So that is another project. Here is another easel card, and I use the clouds and the bicycle there with beautiful flowers. Let me get the stamp to show you. Here's the clouds right there. I used both clouds and the bicycle, and what I did was I stamped it directly on to the card, and then I also cut them out and layered them. So here is the bicycle. And the little clouds there. One's a little peeking out there with a little smiley face. And I just layered and I popped it up with some pop dots and a little balloon. I love the way this card came out. It's just really cheery and I think it's great for any occasion. And here is a slimline card. Grow, love, and beauty. And on that sheet, you see the beautiful butterfly, and I layered the colors. And inside each little section there, you see the love stamp there, the bird cage, and then the bird free. I love the way this card came out. I love using the stamps. I'm just going to get the sheet there. The, there's the love stamp, the bird cage, and then there's the bird. I just love the way this came out. I'm really, really happy with it. See how you can like layer the colors there? And there is that card. Yes, guys, so that is my project share. My review is I really love all of these products. They worked beautifully. I'm really, really happy with them. The prices are amazing. And I just really enjoyed making these projects. So guys, if you don't know, you know, BB Craft does have a YouTube program. And if you have 100 subscribers or more, you can join their program and do what I'm doing and review products and make videos. All right. Make videos to review the products. So thank you to BB Craft yet again. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed my project share and my review. I would highly suggest if you do paper crafting to check out some of these products. The links will be in the description below. And I love that beautiful stencil. 
So everything will be in the description below as well my affiliate links. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. And I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye.